Let's roll. This is the RC Workbench. Okay, today I wanted to take a look at the most popular cameras for the Tiny Whoops. These are the FX 7907T and its sibling, the FX 7908T. This is the 7907T on the left. I've been I've had it decased already uh, to trim off weight for my Tiny Whoop. And uh, this is the 798 right here. The only difference between the two is the way that the right-hand circular polarized antenna is mounted to the uh, to the camera on the 7907T. It has a bit of a mast made out of PC board that the antenna is soldered to, and on the 798T, there is a mast extension made out of dipole, made out of coax cable basically, like a dipole extension that the uh, antenna is soldered to. Um, they both perform the same. Um, the 798T is said to be a little more durable because of the quote unquote flexible mast, but in reality, it doesn't flex at all. It's quite stiff, but people are still having a little better reliability and less breakage with the 798T. These are both 40 channel units and I wanted to plug this in and show you how to change channels. Let me grab a little battery here. All right, so with power to it, you can see there is a little switch here, this little, or a button, it's a momentary switch, a button used for changing channels and changing bands. So with single press will flip between, will cycle between one of eight channels. You can see the, the LED changing, denoting which channel it's on. And the long press, We'll change the band. So it'll flip between one of f five bands. <laughs> um, the uh, last band, the f uh, I believe the fifth one at the bottom is race band. So you have to hold it down for like three seconds for it to change. So once you have the band set, then you can easily cycle between the channels for that but within that band. So with those uh, five bands available and eight channels with each in each one, we have 40 channels available total. To transmit on. So, okay, that's a little quick uh, RC workbench for today. Thank you for watching.